guaranteed that when you come to serve the Lord, as the scriptures say in the book of Sirach, prepare thy soul for temptation, you know, meaning we're going to go through uh, a lot of shit, man. You see, Yahweh Shai himself even told us that, man, when he was talking to the, uh, I think it was James and John, you know, the sons of Zebedee, he told them that you shall surely be baptized with the baptism that I'm going to be baptized with. You shall drink of that cup. And that cup is going into these persecution and the tribulations, all right, and the sufferings, man. You see, and that's a part of that straight gate, and that's a part of uh, uh, of this ministry that a lot of these people, okay, that uh, a lot of our people don't want to go through. You see, that's why you got a lot of these Israelite camps telling our people that there's not going to be any tribulation. They're not going to have to go through anything to make it into the kingdom of heaven. But that's totally contrary to what Yahweh Shah himself said, you see. As the God says, as the scripture said in the book of Acts, much tribulation shall you enter into the kingdom of heaven, man. You see? So going through this, through these sufferings that, we, that we're uh, going through right now, you see, that's a part of it, man. And ultimately, it's a part of uh, uh, this training, you see? These little situations and tribulation that we're going through in our personal walks, and it's true, all right? Whether it be from situations from your job, you know, we all, you know, life, man, just life in general, you see? It's something that, like the scriptures say, <laughs> something that all the brethren, okay, or the believers are taking part in, man, you see? And it says, think not strange of, uh, when these fiery trials shall, shall come upon you, man. You see, showing you that you're going to have to suffer, man, because if you resist the flesh, you see, you see from sin and resisting the flesh comes with what? It comes with suffering. You see, pleasing the flesh, pleasing the flesh comes with what comes with ease is easy. It's something that, the, uh, uh, you know, <laughs> something that you don't have to uh, uh, do anything. You know, you know, it's, it, it comes with no difficulties, man. You see, pleasing the flesh comes with no difficulties, man. And that's that broad way that Yahweh Shah was speaking of, man. That way that uh, leads unto death. That way of the world that everybody likes to, uh, 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 that road that everybody likes to take, man. Nobody want to take the difficult path, man. The straight gate, okay, that place of difficulty. Like Yahweh Shah himself said, there's only a few. Okay, they find that road or, or, or be able to, uh, uh, you know, make it all the way, you know, through that journey, man. You see, because it is a journey, it is a walk. It's not, it's not a cakewalk, man. You see, look how long our apostles and elders have been in this truth, man, and all the and all the stuff that they've been through. But look, they're still here, man, because they they're in the right mindset of uh, uh, keep going because this truth is a marathon, man. You see, this truth is not a, a, a forty-yard dash. You see. That's what a lot of these guys, you know, they come into this thing, think, you know, eventually what they end up, uh, 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 you know, sizzling out, man. That fire, okay, that they came in with when they first woke up, that we all get when we first wake up. You see, you, you're on fire, you more, you, you just, your passion is at, a, at an all-time high, you see. It's new to you, you know what I'm saying? It's, a, it's that new love, you know, and you want to just tell everybody that fire that they have, it eventually, uh, 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 like I said, just fades out, you see. Because they wasn't in this thing, they didn't, they didn't have the mindset of enduring this thing, man. They thought it was just going to be something quick. We all thought that, coming into the truth, man. You see? I'm sure every brother, you know what I'm saying, can, can attest to that, man. When they when they first woke up, man, I, I, mean, I, know, that they, I know we only got two years and we out of this thing. You see? You're thinking that the Lord is going to, you know, the Lord's going to come back in a year or two. You know, but when you first wake up, but look, we still here. You know? We still here for, for you know... <laughs> I mean, I've been in this truth for, I think, about five years, man. You see, I'm still, I'm, we still here, man. You see? That's why it's a marathon. You got to constantly endure these things, man. It's something that you constantly got to grow through. It's a fight. You see? A fight is not easy. A fight is, is difficult. You see? And like I said, it's something that a lot of these dudes, all right, who uh, aren't here anymore, you see? They don't have the, uh, 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 they don't have the discipline or the, uh, uh, or the strength, you know, the spiritual, uh, the mind, you know, the spiritual mind of fortitude to, to, to keep pushing on this thing, man. You see? Because what the Lord is getting ready to do, man, what we see happening, man, they get ready to, that, that real persecution, man, okay? What we going through, like I said earlier, man, this, these are just trials. These are just, this is just training camp, man. You see, the Lord is preparing us with that muscle memory, man. You see? Just like you take boxing, for example. Or you take a, 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 you know, basketball, the coach is constantly running, running, or, or like I said, boxing, they, they're constantly going over these fundamentals, you see? 
the same thing over and over and over fundamentals that way when, when when it actually happens it's muscle memory it's just it's just you know it's just second nature and that's what the lord is doing with us right now okay with these different trials and tribulations that we're going through he's putting us through these trainings to show us to, to showing us to trust in him you see with all these situations you know tribulations that you go through whether it be from your job whether it be from your family or the care of this life you see the lord is directing us and showing us hey look trust in me you see and he's preparing us he's training us to where when we come into the times of tribulation that we get ready to face when we come into that hour of temptation you see when we come into the time of jacob trouble that trusting in him just gonna be muscle memory and we're gonna be able to it's gonna be it's gonna come natural man you see and that's something that we all need to lock into you know what i'm saying these different situations that we're going through in our lives you know it's something that we need to look at with a spiritual eye man and look at the, the bigger picture what the lord is trying to do and how he's shaping and fashioning us for the times to come man Cause like i said man you see seeing this shit, how they're trying to link us to, to, to this uh, uh you know they're trying to link us to, uh, to, uh, to being muslims they're trying to deem us terrorists you got these different you know agent you know Israelite leaders who are, who are participating in trying to, you know, stir up strife, you know, and going to these different marches with the Palestinians and, and causing conflict. All this is just, it's just a, 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 a great slander of persecution on those, like the scripture say. In Second Andrew chapter 16, those that fear the Lord, man, it's going to be a great insurrection. We're coming into the time where that great insurrection is about to, uh, is about to take place, you see. And we're going to have to have that mindset, we're going to have to put on the elect, man, you see. Right now, that's that's that training for us. What the Lord has got us going through this uh, boot camp, man. Putting on the elect right now. That way, when we're faced with this this hour of temptation, when we're faced with these tribulations, okay, we're going to be able to stand. Because like it says in Second Edges chapter 16, it says they're going to cast you out of their house. They're going to spoil your goods. You see, and then shall be known who am I chosen. You see, because the elect are going to have a whole different mindset. You see, they're going to be trained. All right, they're gonna, like it says in Wisdom of Solomon, they're gonna stand in great boldness because they've been, they've been through this training camp. You see, this grace period is a training camp where the Lord is preparing us. Okay, Yahweh Shah is preparing us, man. You see, for victory. You see, because he was, he was the first one who overcame. You see, like it says in, uh, I think it's John chapter 16 in that last verse. Okay, it tells you in the word that you're gonna have tribulation, but be, uh, 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 be of good cheer. You see. But he have overcame the world, and it's through Yahweh and Mashiach that we have this, that we can overcome. It, you see, and the elect is going to overcome, like it says in the Book of Revelation, they overcame by the by the by the blood of the Lamb, man. You see, what you got to do, this 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 is preparation that the Lord is taking us through right now, man. You see, so really prepare your minds, and, and you know, and look at these situations. The Lord is purposely putting us in situations to to force us, all right, to trust in Him. To show us to, to to make our focus okay solely on him man because we can't save ourselves you, you see there's nothing we can do to save ourselves and that's the majority that's the mindset of the majority of these people is thinking that they can save themselves that they can do they can get themselves out of a situation you see they can rely on themselves self-reliance is is is, is uh, uh like the scriptures say cursed the man that trusted the man you see whether you trusted in esau or whether or you trusted in yourself man you see, you cursed by doing that, but you if you trust in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, you can't fail, man. You see? Like it says in second uh, the book of Sarah chapter two, all they have anyone have been forsaken, okay, okay, or or, or or confounded, they trusted in him, you see. So all these situations, man, that we're going through is just training, man. The Lord is apparent preparing that muscle memory, man, you see. That way during the time of Jacob's trouble, we'll be able to it, 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 it's natural, man. You see, these different situations that we're going through, it's just going to be natural for us to trust in the Lord. And no matter what Esau tries to bring, okay, whether he's threatened to take away our food, okay, our, our, our family, you see, our children, you see, or even our lives, man, you see, that we'll be able to stand in great boldness, okay, before the wicked, man, you see, and give all that glory and honor until you're by Shimei Yahweh Shah, man, so... I don't want to make this too long, man. That's it's just been on my spirit, man. I've been thinking about that, man. Hey, prepare yourself, man, because we can see, we see what we see what this devil's doing, man. You see, they're putting all this thing. They, uh, the, the, you know, go look at the other Yashuma video. He, he, he did, man. I think it was today or either yesterday. Going to hey, going into the, these 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 different hotties. <laughs> the, the blender, the slandering is coming, man. 
build these different Israelite camps that Esau set up, man. You see? Whether it be from IUIC or whatever, or, or whatever these other fucking uh, ancient camps that the Lord set up, man. You see? Because it's clear to see that these different dudes that is, is, is going contrary to the scriptures, to the scriptures, man, are uh, set up, man. You see? They're set up, man, at the end of the day. <clears throat> and Esau is getting ready to, 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 to use that to come against the true church. To come uh, to come against the true believers, man. You see? And in that video, the elder was, was playing, the dude was naming all IUIC. He was saying IUIC and all these different other counties were, 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 uh, were, were, were you know, they, they, weren't, they weren't harmful. But GMS, GMS are the troublemakers. Basically trying to make great meals on the troublemakers when you can't go on no fucking video and see brothers fighting no damn body, man. We ain't out there fighting no goddamn body, man. You see, or, ca or causing trouble, or, or telling people to take, telling our people to take on and fight. We're not telling our people to do that shit. You see, but these are all tools of the devil, man. So, hey, man, if you if you paying attention, man, you should see what's up, man. You see, you should constantly be watching, man, and you should constantly, constant, constantly be preparing and building up that that one on one relationship with your how about shit, your how shot, man, because can't nobody else save you, man. We can't save our damn selves, man. It all goes back to that relationship and that time that we put in during this grace period, man. You see, that's the only time, hey, man, because you, you best believe if you going to, if you ain't doing shit now, and you're not taking this this grace period seriously, and you going to, and you lukewarm, and you going to trick Jacob's trouble, thinking you gonna snap into a fucking slim gym, you 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 sadly mistaken, man. You sadly mistaken. All right. So you know what I'm saying, Lord, one of this, you know what I'm saying, this was edifying, man. Lord, one of this is a faith booster, faith booster, man. You know. All right, I want to give all praises on that glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rechav, Kodash, the honor of the apostles of the great millstone, the teacher, and the will, peace and blessings unto the elect. Shalom.